Good morning, Patriots. Welcome to Rex Pines TV. I'm Destiny Mata. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is Tuesday, January 10th, 2023. Now let's do today's relaxing breathing exercise. That was so relaxing. Now let's go learn a new word with word of the day. Hey Nia, did your mom find out you broke the vase? No, I got to rejuvenate it before she noticed. That's good that you got to restore it to its original state. Yeah, I made sure to rejuvenate it to how it was before. I'm glad you didn't get in trouble by restoring it to its original state. See, see you tomorrow, tomorrow on word of the, the day. day. Now let's see what happened today in history with Melanie. Thank you, Destiny. Hey, Patriots. Today in history, on January 10th, 1912, the first flying boat took flight. It was called Model E and was built by American aeronautic pioneer Glenn Curtis. This flying boat made a big impact on military. It inspired soldiers to create models just like it for World War I. Model E was the first flying boat to fly across the Atlantic Ocean. The flying boat was actually a more developed version of the courteous original flying boat called Model D. Wow, these boats are really something to see. Now let's see what's cooking with Jasmine. Thank you, Melanie. Today's lunch is quesadilla with mild salsa, turkey ham sandwich, corn slash lettuce and tomato, pineapple tidbit, and your choice of milk. And tomorrow's breakfast is French toast sticks, syrup cup, graham crackers, fresh orange, 100% apple juice, fruit loop cereal, and your choice of milk. Students, please keep in mind that the lunch and breakfast can change at any time, and to always bring your lunch card. Don't forget to let your teachers know if you will be receiving lunch today. Bon appetit! Now let's get back to destiny. Thank you, Jasmine. A new quarter has started, so you know what that means, Patriots. A new instructional software challenge. For this quarter challenge, K-2 second will need 25 past lessons on iReady Math and 20 minutes weekly on Lexia. And third through eighth, we'll need 25 past lessons on iReady Reading and 25 past lessons on Imagine Math. You have until March 26 to get them done. It's winter testing time, Patriots. Tomorrow, our fifth through sixth graders will be taking their reading fast test. Take a look at the schedule to see when it's your time to test. Good luck, fifth and sixth. Patriots, please don't forget our cell phone policies. It is important to make sure you have your phone shut down and in your backpacks at all times. And also, don't forget you are not allowed to chew gum in school. Make sure to spit it out before you enter the building. Students, the Patriot store is open every morning. Make sure to look at the schedule to see when it's your time to shop and make sure you bring your tickets. As for cheer, the tryouts are being held today for any 5th through 8th graders interested. You will need a completed sports packet to try out. Good luck! Now let's see what our weather looks like today with Sophia. Thank you, Destiny. Good morning, Patriots. For today's weather, you can expect a warm 80 degrees Fahrenheit with sunny skies. In other weather news, Thor was spotted in an English town. Your first thought was probably the superhero, but really, it was a walrus. A walrus probably wasn't the first thing that came to mind since they usually live in the polar region. However, Thor was probably migrating across the sea when he came ashore. If you didn't know, one reason a walrus might migrate is due to climate change, leaving them less habitable waters. So they have to find a home on land when ice is not available. 
This was definitely a sight to see and an interesting way to start off the new year. Now let's go to Hendrick for the birthdays. Thank you, Sophia. Today's birthday boy is John Vasquez. Happy birthday. Now let's go back to Destiny. Thanks, Hendrick. Patriots, here are your pet's expectations. It represents, present yourself positively, act kindly towards others, treat the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Congrats to Ms. Cavalita, Ms. Sharon, Ms. Iron Danqua, Ms. Stone, Ms. Reynolds, Ms. Arno, Ms. Santiago, Ms. Manon, and Ms. Pardinez. You all had the correct response to Monday's Daily Challenge, which was, which state is most famous for Hollywood? The correct answer was California. Now for today's Daily Challenge. Daily Challenge. Raisins originated from which fruit? Teachers, please send your answers to pines.renaissance at gmail.com before 9 a.m. in order for your answer to be reviewed. Runners will be announced on the next morning announcements. Everyone at RPTV would like to wish you all a terrific Tuesday. And remember, here at Pines, we're going to renew excellence in education. Have a great day.